Hey guys, this is Todd with SubjectMoney.com and I'm going to quickly show you how to reduce the margin or spaces between uh, form fields in your contact form. So in this example, I am using, it's, I'm on a WordPress website and I am using contact form 7. Uh, the way that I'm going to show you will work with other contact form plugins. You just have to understand a little bit of CSS. All right, so the first thing that I want you to do is right click anywhere inside your form and then I want you to scroll down to so right click in your form to inspect what you're gonna do is you're gonna find the CSS class for that form alright so we have multiple classes that would work but right here you can see class WPC F7 hyphen form that's in form action you can do that and then you also have the class up here. Obviously, it's like right under free roof estimate, so that's within it. Uh, WPC F7 and then space JS. So that is your contact form. All that you need to do, since it's contact form 7, is copy the first part. But you could also copy this whole thing right here, WPCF7 hyphen form, that class as well. We're going to do the top up here. So for our form division, we're getting our CSS class. We're going to copy it, WPCF7. All right. And then here, you see where it says uh, paragraph, or P is the HTML for paragraph. These are your form fields. So. The reason I'm showing you that, I will get to in just a second. Let's close this out. So we have our CSS class copied. Now what we want to do is we want to get into our theme. We want to customize our theme. So if you're here and you already have your bar, your dashboard bar up here, you can click on customize. But if you're inside your dashboard your, or your, your WordPress dashboard, you would go to appearance and then you would go to customize. And then as this slowly appears, you'll be able to customize your theme here. So we're gonna to go to additional CSS. Then we're gonna paste in our class, control V. Now, right before that, I want you to add a period. And then I want you to add a space after seven and type in P. And then you're going to add your brackets. All right. In your brackets, I want you to type in mar your CSS code. It's going to be margin and then hyphen bottom. And it is popping up here. So I'll click on that. Now you need to add a colon. And then for me, let me get down here in the form so you can see what happens. I'm gonna actually type in, you can experiment with your margin. I'm gonna type in negative 20 PX. Right there you can see that our form is more compressed and it's easier to read on a screen, on a phone. You don't have to scroll. All these little things when you're trying to increase your conversion rate, every little detail matters. Oh, don't forget to hit publish. All right, so that concludes this tutorial. I want you guys to please subscribe to the channel and comment and let me know about any improvements that I can make to these tutorials. I appreciate it. Thank you for watching.